For millennia, humans have gazed at the night sky, questioning our place in the cosmos. We've mapped the stars, unraveled the laws of gravity, and even journeyed to the moon. But what if I told you that our universe is even more bizarre, more wondrous than we ever imagined? What if our reality, the very fabric of space and time, is but a tiny sliver of a grander multidimensional tapestry? Join me as we embark on a journey beyond the three dimensions we know into the realm of unseen dimensions where the universe's deepest secrets reside. Let's begin our journey right here in the familiar three-dimensional world we perceive. Imagine holding a book in your hand. It has length, width, and height, three spatial dimensions that define its shape and position in space. These dimensions are the foundation of our everyday experience. We navigate our world, build our homes, and measure our universe using these fundamental axes. From the smallest atom to the largest galaxy, these three dimensions govern the interactions of matter and energy. They dictate how objects move, how forces interact, and how structures are formed. Without these three dimensions, our universe as we know it would simply cease to exist. But what exactly are dimensions? They're not physical objects, but rather coordinates, a framework for pinpointing the location of anything in space. Imagine a grid, like the lines on a graph paper. Each line represents a dimension, and the point where they intersect is a specific location in space. Think of an architect's blueprint. It represents a three-dimensional building on a two-dimensional surface. The blueprint uses length and width to depict the building's layout, while height is implied, allowing us to visualize the complete structure. Similarly, our three-dimensional world can be thought of as a projection of a higher-dimensional reality. Just like the blueprint, we only perceive a slice of the full picture. This concept might seem strange at first, but as we delve deeper into the realm of physics, the idea of hidden dimensions becomes increasingly plausible. Consider a tightrope walker. From a distance, he appears confined to a one-dimensional line. However, we know he exists in three dimensions, skillfully balancing his weight along the rope's length while utilizing the width and height dimensions to maintain his equilibrium. Our perception of dimensions is limited by our senses and experiences. We're like ants crawling on a flat sheet of paper, unaware of the vastness of the three-dimensional world that surrounds us. But just because we don't directly experience higher dimensions doesn't mean they don't exist. The study of physics has consistently revealed that the universe is far stranger than we initially imagined. From the curvature of space-time to the wave-particle duality of light, reality often defies our intuition. The possibility of additional dimensions, while mind-boggling, is an intriguing avenue of exploration that could unlock some of the universe's most profound mysteries. As we journey further into the realm of higher dimensions, we must keep an open mind. Our intuition, honed by our experience in a three-dimensional world, may not be the best guide. But with a sense of curiosity and wonder, we can begin to unravel the secrets of these hidden dimensions and gain a deeper understanding of the universe we inhabit. Now let's introduce another dimension, one we experience constantly, but rarely consider in its full complexity time. Time, as we perceive it, flows linearly, always moving forward, from past to present to future. We mark its passage through the ticking of clocks, the changing seasons, and the milestones of our lives. But time, as Einstein's theory of relativity revealed, is not an absolute, unchanging entity. It is inextricably linked with space, forming a unified fabric called space-time. Time, in essence, acts as the fourth dimension. Imagine a loaf of bread representing our universe at a single moment. Each slice represents a different point in time. We experience the universe one slice at a time, moving forward through the loaf as time progresses. Just like the three spatial dimensions, time provides a coordinate. To pinpoint an event, we need not only its location in space, its length, width, and height, but also its location in time. This four-dimensional framework is crucial for understanding the universe on a grand scale. Einstein's theory of relativity tells us that gravity is not a force acting at a distance, but rather the curvature of space-time caused by mass and energy. Imagine a bowling ball placed on a trampoline, causing a dip in the fabric. Similarly, massive objects like stars and planets warp the fabric of space-time. This warping of space-time affects not only the path of objects, but also the flow of time itself. Time passes slower in stronger gravitational fields compared to weaker ones. This phenomenon, 
known as time dilation, has been experimentally verified and is a direct consequence of time being an integral part of the space-time continuum. The concept of space-time challenges our everyday intuition about the nature of reality. We tend to think of time as uniform and absolute, ticking away at the same rate for everyone everywhere. But Einstein showed us that time is relative, dependent on one's motion and proximity to massive objects. This revelation has profound implications for our understanding of the universe. It means that time travel, while still confined to the realm of science fiction, is not entirely outside the realm of theoretical possibility. Furthermore, the unification of space and time into space-time has been instrumental in developing our understanding of the universe's origin and evolution. The Big Bang Theory, our best model for the beginning of the universe, relies heavily on the concept of space-time. As we continue our exploration of dimensions, we must remember that time is not merely a passive observer, but an active participant in the cosmic dance. It shapes the fabric of reality, influences the motion of celestial objects, and even dictates the fate of stars and galaxies. Now that we've added time to the mix, we find ourselves dealing with a four-dimensional universe, a concept that can be challenging to visualize. But fear not for physicists have developed elegant ways to represent this four-dimensional realm, allowing us to grasp its intricacies. One way to visualize space-time is to imagine a grid much like the one we used to represent three-dimensional space. However, instead of just three axes representing length, width, and height, we now have a fourth axis representing time. This grid represents the fabric of the universe, a dynamic and ever-changing entity. Imagine stretching a rubber sheet tautly, this sheet represents the fabric of space-time. Now place a ball on the sheet. The ball represents a massive object like a star. Notice how the ball creates a dip in the sheet, distorting the fabric of space-time around it. This distortion, as we discussed earlier, is what we perceive as gravity. Objects moving near the star will follow the curvature of the sheet, just like marbles rolling around a bowling ball on a trampoline. This analogy helps us visualize how gravity works in the context of space-time. But space-time is not just a static backdrop. It's dynamic, constantly being warped and twisted by the objects within it. As objects move and accelerate, they create ripples in space-time, much like a boat moving through water. These ripples, known as gravitational waves, were first predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity and were directly detected for the first time in 2015. This groundbreaking discovery confirmed a major prediction of Einstein's theory and opened a new window into the universe, allowing us to study some of the most violent and energetic events in the cosmos. Imagine a pair of neutron stars, the collapsed cores of massive stars, locked in a deadly spiral. As they orbit each other at incredible speeds, they warp and distort the fabric of space-time, sending out gravitational waves that propagate outward at the speed of light. These waves carry information about the objects that created them, their masses, their spins, and the details of their cataclysmic merger. By studying gravitational waves, we can learn about objects and events that are invisible to traditional telescopes, such as black hole collisions and the very early universe. The study of space-time is not merely an academic pursuit, it has practical applications in our everyday lives. For example, the GPS technology we rely on for navigation relies on the principles of general relativity and the understanding that time passes differently in different gravitational fields. Without accounting for the effects of space-time curvature, GPS satellites would drift out of sync with receivers on Earth, rendering the system useless. This is just one example of how a deeper understanding of the universe can lead to technological advancements that benefit humanity. As we delve deeper into the realm of physics, we find that space-time is not merely a passive stage upon which the cosmic drama unfolds. So far, we've explored the four dimensions that govern our everyday experience. But what if I told you that these might not be the only dimensions out there? What if our universe is just a slice of a much larger multidimensional reality? This is where we venture into the realm of theoretical physics, where some of the most mind-bending ideas about the universe are explored. One such idea is string theory, which suggests that the fundamental building blocks of the universe are not point-like particles, but rather tiny, vibrating strings. Just like a violin string can vibrate at different frequencies to produce different notes, these fundamental strings vibrate in different ways to give rise to all the particles and forces we observe in the universe. But here's where things get interesting. 
String theory requires the existence of extraspatial dimensions, curled up and hidden from our view. Imagine a garden hose viewed from a distance. It appears as a one-dimensional line. However, upon closer inspection, we see that it has a second dimension, curled up in the form of a circle. Similarly, string theory proposes that our universe has additional dimensions, compactified to such a small scale that we don't perceive them directly. These extra dimensions are not just a mathematical quirk. They play a crucial role in the consistency and stability of string theory. Just as the tension and length of a violin string determine its vibrational modes, the size and shape of these extra dimensions determine the properties of the fundamental strings and, consequently, the laws of physics in our universe. String theory, in its various forms, suggests that there could be six or seven extraspatial dimensions, each curled up in a unique way. These hidden dimensions could hold the key to understanding some of the biggest mysteries in physics, such as the unification of gravity with the other fundamental forces and the nature of dark matter and dark energy. Another intriguing theory that suggests the existence of extra dimensions is M-theory. M-theory is a more encompassing framework that attempts to unify all the different versions of string theory. It proposes that our universe is not the only one, but rather exists on a membrane or brain floating in a higher dimensional space. Imagine a stack of pancakes with each pancake representing a different universe. These universes could be separated by a tiny distance in the extra dimensions, and occasionally they might even collide, potentially giving rise to events like the Big Bang. The idea of a multiverse, while speculative, is a fascinating consequence of these higher dimensional theories. It suggests that our universe, vast as it may seem, is just one of many, each with its own unique set of physical laws and constants. While the existence of extra dimensions remains a topic of active research and debate, the possibility is too tantalizing to ignore. If true, these hidden dimensions could hold the key to unlocking a deeper understanding of the universe and its fundamental nature. As we've journeyed through the dimensions, from the familiar three of space to the elusive realm of higher dimensions, we've encountered concepts that challenge our perception of reality. But our exploration wouldn't be complete without pondering the scale of the universe itself. Our observable universe, the portion we can see from Earth, is estimated to be about 93 billion light years in diameter. This vast expanse contains billions of galaxies, each teeming with billions of stars, many orbited by planets, some potentially harboring life. But the observable universe might be just a tiny fraction of a much larger, potentially infinite, universe. Imagine standing on the surface of a vast ocean, able to see only as far as the horizon. Just as there's more ocean beyond our sight, there could be much more universe beyond what we can currently observe. The concept of an infinite universe is both awe-inspiring and humbling. It suggests that our planet, our solar system, our galaxy, even our observable universe, is but an infinitesimal speck in the grand scheme of things. Furthermore, if the universe is infinite, it raises the possibility of an infinite number of variations within it. Imagine an infinite deck of cards. Every possible combination of cards would exist somewhere within that deck. Similarly, an infinite universe could contain an infinite number of variations of everything we see around us. There could be other Earths out there, other yous, living out different lives, making different choices. The implications of an infinite universe are profound and challenge our understanding of our place in the cosmos. It suggests that the universe is not just vast in scale, but also in its possibilities. However, even if the universe is finite, its sheer size and the mind-boggling distances involved make it likely that we'll never be able to explore it all. The speed of light, the cosmic speed limit, while incredibly fast, becomes a barrier when dealing with the vastness of the universe. Even if we could travel at the speed of light, it would take billions of years to reach the edge of the observable universe, and even longer to explore any potential regions beyond. But this limitation should not discourage us, but rather inspire us to learn as much as we can about the universe from our vantage point here on Earth. Every new discovery, every piece of knowledge we gain, brings us closer to understanding our place in the grand cosmic tapestry. As we conclude our exploration of dimensions, from the familiar three of our everyday experience, to the uncharted territories of higher dimensions, and the mind-boggling scale of the universe itself, we're left with a sense of wonder, 
and a thirst for more knowledge. The universe is full of mysteries, waiting to be unraveled. We may never know all the answers, but the pursuit of knowledge, the drive to explore the unknown, is what makes us human. So keep looking up at the night sky, keep asking questions, and keep exploring the cosmos. For within its infinite expanse lie endless possibilities waiting to be discovered.